Hey guys, welcome back to the Ultimate Sim. I'm Landros. Now it took Devin till five o'clock in the morning to actually get back home um, because he decided to walk the entire way. So uh, yeah, I could have just turned on the testing cheats and just teleported him, but I didn't. And you just went to bed. What is your problem? Oh, this stupid thing. I'm going to have to get rid of it. Um, let's get him in bed. Nothing else has happened. I just actually got Madeline to learn to walk and she's playing. Uh, I was going to have them do something, but apparently, he just, like I said, he decided he'd rather walk than get home. I did give him a sleeping potion because he has to work later, so he'll be okay. All right, I'm going to work with Madeline for a little bit. I'll come back and we'll get started with this day. All right, well, we've kept the butler up pretty much all night long. Um, either me or the fact that she just keeps going over there and getting some kind of hot drink. So uh, she's exhausted. She keeps getting that negative um, bubble above her head. Madeline needs to talk to somebody, and I was going to have Lacey do it. Dawson has nothing to do. He broke the shower, so I was waiting to see if she fixes it or if Lacey can go up and do it. Then we will never have to worry about it breaking again. Um, he wants to talk to her. I'm just going to say ignore that, and then just do this. You, no, you're not going to do that. You're going to come down here, and you're going to grab some juice, and then I'm going to have you work with your daughter for a little bit. Um, oh, hush. Yeah, I know. She should actually... You know what? Uh, I'm sorry. We're going to go upstairs and take care of this real quick. I know, I know. Because I don't know how long it's going to take this stupid maid to do it. Or butler. Anyway, we'll go take care of that. And then she's not just that desperate. But she is. <clears throat> so, Madeline, I'm going to have you stop. And you're going to start screaming in just a minute. I'll give you one to work on. Did you not... <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Do what you want to do. Yeah. Take your time. Maybe the butler will go up there and fix it in the meantime. I don't really care. Just somebody fixes it. Um, let's go ahead and take care of her social. That's all that she really cares about. So, once we get that taken care of, we are done. Um, oh, hush. <laughs> you really are. Now, I do need to actually teach her how to um, go to the bathroom. But right now, we're working one little bit at a time. And that should have done pretty much. Uh, it's almost to the top. And your fun still isn't going up with this. Okay, when you're done, put her back in there. And then while you're downstairs, let's go ahead and grab something to drink. And I was hoping that your husband was up, which I think he is. He's working today. No, he's not. He needs to go entertain sick kids. If he'll get up, get up. I'm sorry. He took the potion and he should have been up already. All right, now you should be able to finish this thing up and we'll get you moving on to the next one. I need to get the porta potty thing um, so that she can use it. What did you go do? Anything? Oh, you were drinking. Um, all right. I bet you did the butler go to sleep. I don't know what the butler's doing, but we're going to go ahead and repair it. Hopefully, because I don't know where the butler went. She may have left. <laughs> she may have said, I've had enough. I'm done. Or she could be downstairs working. I don't see her. I have no idea where she might be. But she's not here. And I didn't see her up here. She may have gone home. I have no idea. Right, Devin, I told you what I want you to go do. So you should be good. She's fine. Her fun's going up a little bit at a time. If I let her play the game, she probably would do a pretty nice thing. Um, for right now, I'm not too concerned. You, you're almost done with this. Let me go ahead. I'm going to put in the toilet thing here. Just because I don't want to have to take her upstairs and then bring her back down. Just to go and um, do the training. I'm playing another game, which is a much older save file and has a lot of stuff. And going into build by is never an issue, but it's just the amount of stuff that's on your lot. And this house has so much in it. Um, it's a bit too much, so that's why we have such a long lag time to get in and a lot of uh, time to get out of Bill by So it just it happens. Well, good. At least she, if she fixes it, then we don't have to worry about this thing ever getting broken, which is good. I never knew that that was one of the challenges that you could get with handiness. I never really messed with the challenges for the longest time. I just got them to level 10 and said, okay, I'm not doing anything extra. Um, oh, wait, is that your carpool already? I guess you're not doing any of this. You slept too long, buddy. You really did. Anyway, um, I never did those challenges, and so for me, it was like, 
Why in the world have I not been doing this? All right, go down here and pick her up because apparently she's done. <clears throat> oh, hush. All right, you go ahead and stop. And then we're going to get her taken care of. Devin, I know you need to go to work, but you just have to wait on her. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's all we can do. Okay. No room. And once you get her in the arms, I can actually take care of this from this point. Okay, let's go ahead and actually start potty training. And I forgot. Did I keep you as family oriented? I know I changed your traits. Oh, I did. Okay, so this shouldn't take long. Probably no more than four, I would think. All right, now he was driving me nuts. He would keep getting up out of bed. Oh, good, you did eat. Or you did get out. Let's go ahead and have you eat something real quick. I took a lot of his scrap out because he had like 200 scrap in his inventory. So I got rid of some of that. You, I certainly hope you make it to work in time. You got three minutes and you better hurry. <laughs> you better start running. Yep, you're missing work. Darn it. And you got to watch him because he will stop and not go to work. I'm having, fighting that issue with one of my characters in another game. It's like they just want to skip work every single chance they get. Alright, let's go ahead and see if you yeah, still need to meet people. Okay, so you would like to go dancing and I would like to take you dancing today might be a good day to do it if we can get some more things done with this kid um, uh, yeah you can go I think she's got to go to the same place doesn't she yeah so they're both gonna go to the Brightmore tonight that'll be fun um, we'll get those challenges out of the way do I care about Dawson no at this point um, he's had his career he's got his lifetime wish achieved I'm not too concerned if he gets a five-star status or not, because apparently he can get in no matter what. He hasn't had any issues so far. He doesn't need the shower of power. <laughs> it does aggravate you, so you might want to blow it up, but we'll be nice. Look through. See, if you would go to bed instead of sitting here drinking all this stuff, you know, you might not be as tired. What's her name? Shonda. Shonda Schaefer. So we got a third maid, or butler. I keep calling him a maid. <clears throat> I hate that they have to walk all the way over here and wait for the kid to walk over there. But I guess there's not enough room. I mean, technically there is. But see, she does this, and then she'll go right over here, get something else to drink, and stay up. She ought to just pass out. <laughs> she should. There she goes. <laughs> all right, sorry, Butler. <laughs> She's gone. Well, you know, what do you expect? It's kind of crazy. Now the main thing I want to do with um, with Madeline is just go ahead. We got the walking done. We're getting the potty training done. The walker is pretty much finished. So what I'm going to do is take the walker out of here. Otherwise, they'll put her in there and I don't need her in there. Okay. Now Lacey, what you're going to do is you are going to just snuggle with her a little bit. You didn't get any other wishes at all that I can work with. I don't really want to do any of this. I mean, if it was a ninja vanish, I'd say yes. Get rid of that. And we're going to put her in here. We'll get her started on talking. Um, and then for you, I'm going to send you downstairs. You know what you're doing. <laughs> you know exactly what I got you doing. You're going to discover a few um, a few drinks. So why don't you go create a couple of drinks while we're working on her. Devin, poor guy, they will feed you at work eventually. Poor guy is starving, and I couldn't help him at all. Um, that's worth 1500 and that's not worth much, so we're going to just go lock that in. Okay, thank you very much. Now everybody leave this kid alone while I work on her. <laughs> I'm going to try my best. Okay. Now that should do enough. That should be enough to get her covered. Uh, Shelton. <laughs> I like the Simpods. I really do. <laughs> they are funny. And this one is kind of, kind of unique. I'm curious to see what he looks like as a real person. Um, I won't change him, but I would. I really would like to know. It's okay. And I'm glad he found something uh, used for this. I figured this would be a wasted room, but apparently he likes it. So I'm happy for him. Uh, in the original one, they had something here, and it blocked the screen because they had a smaller TV up here. I just swapped out the TV, and I put all this stuff on the floor. So it works. It doesn't make any issues. All right, you not really appropriately dressed to be around your kid, and... Uh, your adult kid either so you could have picked something different this just bothers me that they won't feed the poor guy it's already almost four o'clock um, of course he did just go to, to work at one so I can't really be too upset with him okay you uh, 
Now, even though she's a vampire kid, she still has everything in green. That doesn't happen until she becomes a young adult. I don't think it happens at teenage. I think it's young adult. She also doesn't get any of the benefits like fast learning until she becomes a young adult. So that's unfortunate for her, but it's not that big of a deal for us. So we're not going to make a big deal of it. All right, Devin, you met everybody. Well, can somebody that you met feed you? <laughs> I mean, just please, anybody at this point. Good, she learned this one. And I got my happy music. I don't know why I like that music, but I do. I don't, it has no meaning whatsoever. Okay, as far as these, um, you know, I don't remember. Did we finish up the bar drinks at that other place? That, um, I think we did. <laughs> I don't remember. All right, so we need to create, uh, gosh, 13 more. Yeah, we'll be doing this for a while. But I just figure if she just does like maybe one or two a day, um, we should be good. It may take her forever, then again it may not. Alright, what are you going to do? <laughs> He's like, I don't know. Right, you want to go brush your teeth a couple of times? Three times? Since you're right here, let's do it. No, go brush your teeth. <laughs> oh, is he in the way? How did he get in there? Oh, there's a door. He wanted to go see him. Okay, there we go. There's another one. Okay. Um, I'm gonna let you just learn one more. So I'm waiting on her to finish this up. Hey, everybody wants to drink. <laughs> That's the thing to do in Bridgeport nowadays. Alright, fine. Well, she seems to be working just fine after her little pass out session, so can't be too upset with her there. Um, you I don't really have anything for you to do, so whatever you like to do is fine with me. If it's, oh, it's already 5 o'clock. We need to go. So forget this. When you get, um, when you get done with this, let's have you go over here. We're going to bring Dawson and Shelton. Uh, I'm not bringing anybody else. <laughs> In fact, you know what? I'd rather you go now because it may take us forever to get there. And then we're going to have this issue of getting back. So we'll go. That music's going to go. <laughs> music's done. They fed him finally at work, which I'm happy. And he's about to get out, so I'm going to have him come over here too. Figure might as well bring everybody so I can control them all in one lot. Alright, let's get you up and get you out. Old man, come on. I still can't believe he's old. I really can't. It just went too fast. Um, I don't know. It really was not what I expected it it didn't actually last as long as I had hoped. Okay, I think that makes 13 drinks for her. 12 or 13, I can't remember. I don't know if, she's, if she discovered one after that, after we checked, or if not. I'm not sure. Shelton, are you coming, or are you already downstairs? Oh, he's already there waiting. He's like, I'm gone. I am gone. Yes, yeah, not really busy, but that's okay. I don't care if it's busy. It's not my main issue. What I really want to do is I want to go ahead and get him in here. And then you guys, you're going to go ahead and go down with Dawson. And you are going to go ahead and come on down. Just go down on your own. Um, Alright, good. So she learned how to talk. Let me go back up here with her real quick. Tell her I want her to just keep working on something. Um, let's get rid of this because I don't need that. Alright, this will keep you busy for a while. And I will forget about it, but at least I know that I've got the big three done. Alright. The three of you, not there yet, but he is. <laughs> Let's get you back over here to the cage. You're going to go over here in extreme dance. And you you are thirsty, but I don't think there's much that you can get from the bar that would be something you would like. Um, yeah, I don't think you can get like plasma juice and all that. So we're just going to have her drink uh, or eat actually a plasma fruit, which we need to get more of those. It's not that bad. It's not a big issue, but, you know. I'd like to get some more. And then you're, you're going to come over here and dance. And please don't. Oh, I hate when they do that. Did you eat? I don't know if you ate. Let me see. Nope, you didn't eat. Did everybody just get knocked out except for Shelton? All right, you go over here and dance. And you come over here and you dance. Nope. And I know he's hungry too. I didn't actually I didn't even look at his needs. I don't know why. I was just kind of ignoring him. I wasn't doing it on purpose, I just did it. Um, let's see, you... Wow, it's going to take you a while to get here, doesn't it? Isn't it? You want to actually raise your charisma skill, so I think what we'll do is we will raise that while you dance too. 
Um, since you ate, I should not have any needs for you to fill, so we're good. Well, at least I'm, we're getting music this time. I was surprised. Last time we didn't get anything. I like this little room. I don't know why I do, but I just love it. Um, I don't know. It's just kind of cute. I think it'd be pretty interesting to see. I wouldn't want to go dance in it by myself, but, you know, he, he's having a good time. So, oh, you going to go in here and dance too? All right, fine. Um, well, just do something, buddy. You're wasting your time. What was that? Club dance or? No. Just do. Oh. What is wrong with you that you can't dance? You know, that's your whole point. The whole purpose of you being here is just to dance. If you can't do it, I'm going to have you dance with somebody and maybe that'll help. Um. Alright, good. At least he's moving now. That was kind of weird. Oh, lady, what do you got on your head? <laughs> She's all ready for Mardi Gras. Well, that's not for a few months, so we can just deal with it. In real life, that's actually not true, but that's okay. In this game. All right, Devin, start dancing, even though um, you're supposed to go to the hospital tomorrow. I don't think you have any other opportunities. I hope you can get, to get that thing done, but apparently I just can never seem to work the time out with you. Of course, yesterday you were so tired you walked all the way home. Which you probably walked here too. I'm not happy with that either. <laughs> I like her dancing. Okay. Alright, you got charisma up to six. I guess I could actually push that a little bit further. Since you got that one done. Let's see. Befriend all your coworkers. We could try it. I'm not really sure that you're going to get there. Um, um, not really immediately. Oh, you're still listening. Alright, cool. So as long as you still have something going on. Oh, ten minutes. <laughs> That's really good. Alright, she is getting about halfway. What about you? No. <laughs> You're a little bit behind. Not too bad. Is this paparazzi? Is that why she's just sitting around? Yeah, it is. Can you at least ask her to dance or something? Yeah, call over to dance so she doesn't look like just some kind of creeper just sitting there like an idiot. Yeah, go over here and dance and make the bar look like there's people here too and having fun a good time. So, there you go. Um... Now our music's gone. Eh, well, it's too bad. Now this bar, I didn't know that it had the hot tub for the longest time. I just kept forgetting because I never go over to this side. Or when I did, I mean, it was like, I'd come over here and I was like, oh yeah, there was a hot tub. Because I remember seeing something about it. I was like, oh, that's cool. Um, I don't really use the hot tubs here that much since we have one at our house. Probably won't use the one at the house either. Um, typically, I don't. I know hot tubs came with late night, but I use them in the other worlds, so it's kind of weird. You'll see me use them a lot, probably in Hidden Springs, so at least I did with my other game. All right, lady, you're leaving? That's fine. You can go ahead and go. We don't really need you here. Okay, you, you're good. Um, I know he's going to want to eat something pretty quick, and he's getting tired, but I want this thing done so I don't have to come back and do it later. Uh, if you want to have a drink, you can have a drink. Did you have to brush him once? Oh, you did him twice. And what is this one? You know, I'm going to get rid of this because we're not doing a band right now. Um, you, you are so close. Um, very close. Do you, you're done. Hang on a minute. I'm going to pause him while I get her set up. Because I told you I'd forget her. I didn't really forget her. I just knew that she wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> she was going to stay right here. I don't think the butler will actually do anything with her unless they absolutely have to. So... <clears throat> All right, they're having a good time. I mean, they're keeping the fun level high, which was good. I mean, we started off the episode with her fun down, but she's done pretty well. Um, when you get done with this, I really have nothing for you to do, so you can continue just dancing, having a good time. Um, you already got your five stars, so it doesn't really matter. I just wanted to get that out of the way. You need your five stars, and you're close. But if I knock on here to go get something to eat, you'll stop. And I don't want you to stop. I want you to finish up. What about Shelton? Shelton, you're in great shape. You're having the best time just over here in your own little area. Oh, man, you're too hungry to, to do this. Let's get you fed. Go ahead and actually get something. I know, buddy. I know. You were going to do it yourself, but I'll do it for you. So let's get you fed and then let you finish up. You only have to do this for about 30 minutes. So you're almost done. I know you're old, but you can dance for 30 more minutes. I promise you. Especially when it's worth, what, 2000 Uh No, probably worth 1000 because I think Lacey has that opportunistic um, reward, which doubles all of her rewards. 
it's a good one to have, and he probably ought to have it, but I didn't give it to him. I didn't give him anything at all. I'm kind of saving their points for the end. Um, when we get to the final destination, we have something that we will do with all of these characters. And so that's why you probably are wondering, why am I not spending all the, the, um, the lifetime reward potions? It's There's a reason. So um, don't worry. <laughs> we will get to them, and we'll probably use... All of them, or most of them, when we finally get there. All right, why don't you come out over here and try dancing again. Get this thing done, and then it's already almost too midnight. Bad. Not too bad, actually. We might get this thing done before 1 o'clock and get out of here. Of course, this bar stays open pretty late, so you don't have to worry. She learned all the drinks here, so really, um, she's just having a good time. Um, oh, no. You're not friends with her? Why? You're not scandal. No. <laughs> I like how he's dancing. He may be old, but he's he still got moves. Okay, you still are you doing your thing? She's almost out. Okay, I'm going to send... Um, when he gets this thing done, we're going to send him out of here. He is so close. I don't want to mess him up, but I'm going to send him out home. Him to go home first, because he may end up doing the same thing as yesterday and walking home. And if he does, he'll just make me aggravated. I really would not like that, but I can't do much about it. All right, so you guys are ready to go. Why don't we go ahead and send you guys all to the house. And then I'm going to go over and check on Madeline. I'm going to bring everybody up here. Let's see. Go ahead and continue playing. I'm assuming you need it. Is that the way you dress for work? <laughs> I guess it is. Wow. She has a completely different look. Um, I'm going to have you guys come on up here. You can go to sit there. If I just send everybody up here to sit, then I know they'll make it here. At least I hope they will. Um, you go ahead and sit here. And you go sit here. Otherwise, they may just sit down at the lobby and not do anything. Speaking of which, I know it's Thursday. This was, um, or no, it's Thursday now. So we don't have bills. Hopefully we didn't have any that we forgot to pay. <laughs> I think we paid them. Yeah, we paid them. So we'll wait till tomorrow to actually stop and get the mail. All right, you, you're right here. Devin left before you. I bet you he's behind you. Told you. You idiot. <laughs> you're just driving me nuts with this walk. Can't take you anywhere because all you're going to do is walk. Oh, well. <clears throat> I guess maybe if I reset you, that might help. Um, I'm going to try it. Let's just go ahead and reset him just because I know you can use a mod to fix that. And I had the mod in. I took it out. Um, let's go ahead and reset you, and hopefully that'll work. Where are you at? <laughs> I lost everybody, and I lost control. Okay, since you're here, I'm going to go ahead and do this now. Go ahead and get the mail, and I'm going to send you up. Oh, it doesn't even have your name on the door anymore. Or It said the Dean residence. Well, we need to change that, and that's easy to do. Okay, I'm going to get him fed, um, and get him to bed, because... He is kind of tired. And I'm going to get everybody else kind of situated as well. So I'll be back in just a minute. We'll pick up with Festival Day. All right, well, they still haven't Ooh. gone to bed. But um, her fun went down, like, drastically. And his was down eh, because of the reset. I don't know what happened to her. She was full at just a minute ago. But then all of a sudden, it's like, bam, back down to halfway. Um, and actually, it was lower. So anyway, I'm going to have a woohoo and then send him off to bed. She finished the abacus. So all she's doing is this um, play with the mirror. And then she's done with this. So, that's the only bad thing about these items, is that it makes it very quick and easy to take care of the toddler skills. And then you're just stuck with taking care of the kid. But I will probably take her out of the crib, and then, or out of this, and just let her go back to the crib, and we will have to deal with the kid the best way we can. Alright, be right back. And of course, they broke the shower. <laughs> what else do you expect? Alright, well, the only one up, of course, is Shelton, and... Um, Madeline has finished everything. She finished up the charisma, so we're really done with this um, this playpen. So I'm going to get her out of here. Let's go ahead and have you just take care of social a little bit. Let's get your relationship slightly better. Um, I don't think they have much of a relationship at all, if anything. Anyway, just snuggle with her, um, to attack her, and then <laughs> put her down. Okay, and I'm going to take this and stick it out of here so that nobody sticks her in there by accident. Now she is actually going to have to just... Age up the best way she can. All right, we're going to move this over and this one over. Um, wherever you want to put her down is fine, actually. I just want her to actually go to this and start playing. And Shelton, I believe your needs are pretty much fed, so they're met. So I'm going to have you get out of her way. <clears throat> oh, you messed her up, didn't you? All right, go ahead and play. 
and then can you not get there? All right, there's an issue, so we'll move the issue or move that. Now can you do it? And you're not going anywhere, kid. Um, no, you you stay here. You're not going down there. Don't go down. Oh, good lord. Hold on. Are you kidding me? Can you at least play with this one then? Alright, fine. At least that one's working. Just stop. And don't go anywhere. I'm tired of you. Alright, go ahead and play with her. And then that way, you guys have got something to do. And she'll stay socially um, fulfilled. You and you, <laughs> you're fine. Um, Dawson... You didn't sleep the whole night either. I, I thought you were going to. That's fine. Uh, who needs to go home? You? You. Oh, the mailman. <laughs> I don't need him. All right, well, Dawson, tell you what. If the mailman's already here, then that means we could go down and pay it and not have to mess with it. Let's go down, pay the bills, and get your mail. At that point, I don't really care what you do. I'm going to go up here, make sure they're working. Um, at least we'll get all the skills done for the house. Because the only thing I have to do besides these two pieces right here is just go do the books at the library. So I got plenty of time to go do that. Um, I do have Devin set up to buy them because he doesn't have a strong re a relationship with his daughter. Lacey's maxed out, so she doesn't have to do anything at this point. But Devin definitely needs it. Okay, when you get up, which is going to take forever because I didn't give you a potion, which I kicked myself. I thought about it after the fact and then didn't do it. Um... Go ahead and have your plasma juice. Are you going to go downstairs like I asked? Yes, you are. And, um, you... You're going to go. You're leaving here as soon as you get out. Which is now. I'm not even going to let you uh, sleep in. You go, because I want you to, um... Don't even bother with buying the books. In fact, we're going to do this. We're going to have you listen to Charisma on the way. Go get this out of the way. Oh, he's, he got knocked out because she passed out. Well, if this idiot would go to bed, I gave you a really good bed, and you won't use it. Let's go down here and change this one. That's your bed. Now go use it, and you'll get a decent, nice sleep. Oh, she went to this one. I don't know. <sighs> I really think that is the stupidest thing in the world. It's his wife. He can woohoo with her all day long. Ugh. Um, didn't she get this thing? Can you oh, you can transfer it. All right, Devin. Did you do what I asked you to do? You did. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and actually cure Devin before you go any further. Zap it and go. I don't care if you lost all your friends. Oh, you're still scandalized. Would you just go? <laughs> just get out of here. At least he's moving, so he's working just fine. I, I love what you're wearing. I <laughs> really do. The baseball hat, the sweater vest, it's all working for you. <laughs> it's too funny. Okay, I don't know. Oh, he's going to get in and check the sink. Um, I got these wishes here, and I thought I told you to do it. Um, we'll figure out which sink you want to go to. Um, you're having a party. I don't really want to go to it. We might, but I doubt it. Um, say so while you're here, let's go ahead and actually wash your hands. And Lacey, when you get up, I think I told you what I wanted you to do. Let's get that, and then I'm gonna have you come down here and just try to create two. That should have taken care of it, but it didn't. Is it brush your teeth? No wonder. Gosh, no wonder. I'm sorry. I was thinking it was something different. I thought he wanted to wash his hands. I just didn't look. Ah, well, whatever. Okay, so she's got one skill point in this. That's fine. Um, we're not going to send fest. We could, but I'm not going to. Lots of letters, lots of mail. Um, who's your friend? Romeo? If that's the only one. Seriously, I can fix that. Um... Dawson can fix that, I think. Or Devin can fix that. Oh, he doesn't know, um, not Devin, Dawson, yeah. He doesn't know that many people either, though. I don't think he does. Do you know Romeo? No, see, you don't know that. Well, you do know a lot more people than I thought. But you don't know Romeo. So it's not going to help me. Uh, Lacey does, so she can fix that for him if she wanted to. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. He'll, he'll take care of himself. Now you're in there taking care of your opportunity. Lacey, are you going downstairs yet? Please tell me you are. Good. I really don't know who this is on the phone. I bet you they're going to want us to go dance in a bar. Oh, wait, there's a party. Um, at 1 o'clock? Seriously? It's a little early, isn't it? Um, I know where he lives. I believe he's over here. He's supposed to be. Yeah, he's right there. Are they home? Oh, and they are home. Darn it. Fine. We'll go to the party. Uh, you don't get to do what I wanted you to do. That's okay. We're going to leave everybody else at home. I'm just going to worry about her. I've got them set. Whoa! Bright light. <laughs> Bright light. Where am I at? Oh, not with you. That was really weird. <laughs> okay, get down here. All right, go to the party, and we'll leave everybody else here to do what I've got them doing. Seriously, <laughs> get changed, and let's go. She's like, um, I didn't want to go. I was enjoying myself here. Well, you'll enjoy yourself there, too. I need to check on... He's in good shape. She's she's in good shape, too. Um, she'll probably finish this up and then get to the point where she has to get um, changed and go to bed. And Dawson, you're just going to get drunk. <laughs> That's good for me. Uh, you want to have a drink? Can you have one yourself? Can you make one on your own? I don't know if you can or not. Oh, yes, you can. I don't think it counts, though. Um... We'll try it. We'll see if it does. I think you have to actually get one from the bar. Yeah, it says have it at the bar, so I don't think that's going to work. That's okay. It was worth a try, and it gives him something to go down and do. Um, now, does she have a car in her inventory? I think I put it in the family inventory, so she does not have a... Oh, no, she's got this one. So you should be able to go, hopefully, and we won't have to stop through the um, subways. At least I hope we don't. It's good. It's not her car, but that's not a big deal. I mean, technically they're all her cars. <laughs> she inherits everything. Because everybody goes. Everybody dies. Except for her. It is kind of sad and morbid when you think about it. So I play a game where everybody dies but one. Um, now this house, did I ever live in this house? I think I did. I think this was the house I had. I'll know for sure if I get... Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I remember this house. <laughs> okay. Let's get in here and let's go say hi to you, whoever you are. Um... Let's just, uh, eh, let's do a mind meld. Why not? You have nothing better to go do. Um, yeah, this was the house that Matthew and, no, the house that Layla and Josh actually got in my season, my late night LP, which was crazy. <laughs> we did some horrible things to them in this house. Had them get mixed up with each other, and poor kids were so messed up. Um, Turned out okay in the end, but still, it was bad for a while. Oh, you're all dressed up, Layla. Thank you. Um, and who are you? Do I know you? Oh, yeah, we know you. All right, well, it doesn't seem like this is going to be much of a party. Why don't we go ahead and... Um, no, I really don't want to do any of that. Okay. Do you know this guy? No. Let's go talk to him real quick. And you know Maddie. Go ahead and talk to him for a little bit. And we know him because he obviously invited us to the party. We'll just be social. Um, let's go over and ask or talk to everybody. Oh, she's going to get in the hot tub too. That's what I was going to go do. Alright, so when you're done, go ahead and jump in the hot tub. Even though you are a vampire, you're creeped out. Um... I could take this and not have to worry about it, but she, the sun's going to go down in about two hours, so by the time she actually gets the effects of it, it shouldn't be a problem. Um, who is this idiot? Christian Kaiser. I don't know who he is. I don't know what his reason for being here. He's not a celeb. Um, I'm fine. Okay, you, you're still good. You're going home. Poor guy's hungry. I'm gonna let him go home and eat. And then we should go to the festival later on tonight. At least make an appearance. I mean, we don't have to. It's not a big deal. But I haven't gone. I think we went to the summer festival and that was it. Alright, so why don't you chat with her for a little bit? Um. Yeah. I'm waiting to see if we get the, um. What's we call it? You can't do that inside the hot tub. You don't have to get out, do you? 
Okay, well, once we get them, let's see, you, they're all in good shape, actually. Um, I want to go check on you, see how close you are to this. I know she needs to go to the bathroom, and she needs to eat. Let's see, oh, Shelton, you stopped playing with her, didn't you? You're such a jerk. <laughs> you did that on purpose. All right, let's go ahead and pick her up. Let's go ahead and actually snuggle with her for a little bit. I'm going to have you take her upstairs, because she's going to start crying on me in a little bit. We are going to give her a um, change. Oh, please. Really? You have to go down there? And we will go ahead and actually change her diaper and then feed her on the floor. Lacey, I'm going to send you out of here since you're at the hot tub. Uh, you're not really too concerned about it. It's not the best thing in the world, but it's not the best party. Not the worst. Let's go over here. There's something I want to do here. Let's see. You're ready. You're going to come over here. You, you might as well come on over. You have nothing better to do. And when you get done with all this, you're going to come over and we'll let the, um, what's my doodle? The, the butler take care of the kid. She can put her in the crib. She will do that for us at least. I, I know that. Uh, you were creeped out by who? I don't know. Oh, Layla. Well, Layla can do that to you. <laughs> she can. Oh, you can't you can't be in Bridgeport without a car. You really can't. If you rely on that stupid subway system, that is just the biggest pain. But this, you can zip around and be anywhere you need to be really quickly. Okay, um, what I wanted for her, the only real main reason I was coming over here. Where is it? It's over here. I want you to come over here, and we are going to get this... What should we call it? We're going to summon whatever we can, if we can. You're not always successful, but we're going to try to get the fog. Sometimes they're successful at it, sometimes they're not. You just have to do different attempts, but I never do it. <clears throat> it's supposed to make it really easy to hunt or something. I don't know. Like I said, never play the vampires. It's very, very rare. Um, I like the ones for... Is it the witches? I don't know. There's one. If his light, if his eyes light up and all that, then you know that it's successful. Otherwise, it may just do nothing. I think you have to wait a while before you can do it again. We didn't do this as a witch or as a werewolf, which means the next time we actually become those life states, we're going to have to go and interact with it. There we go. All right, so we've got the eclipsing fog. It's going to show up in just a little bit. It won't take long. I promise it won't. It's supposed to make it easier for you to do the things you need to do um, as a vampire. All right. Um, I don't see the fog yet. <laughs> I really don't, but that's okay. Why don't you jump up here and go snowboarding in your in your skirt, to your little dress, and everything? Let's go ahead and do that. Are you are you on your way? No. You're probably already here. I bet you you're already here. And I'm, yeah, you're already here, and I'm complaining about you. I'm so sorry. All right, you need to get this back to her before I forget about it. Um, is he here? Oh, he's here. Are you coming? I don't know where he is. Oh, he's way over here. It's taking him forever to get out of here. All right, fine. Well, we're going to stay here, make sure they don't leave, which they will. Um, let's have you go to the bathroom, and which one is the guy's? Well, obviously that would be it. So let's go ahead and use that. Dawson, you need the bathroom? No, you're good. You need to eat, though. So I will forget, and then you're going to be starving and screaming at me. So let's go ahead and have you buy some food. Um, Shelton, you've got your own food you can deal with. Dawson has mastered skating. Well, it's about time. I mean, I'm sorry. Did we do that? We did it a lot over in Barnacle. Well, not a lot. We went to every one of the festivals, I believe, for the most part. I think we might have missed one. Um... So I tried to make sure they went over there and did it. Okay, good. They're all here. Um, you, now that you're here, have some of the scraps. I don't want to be stuck with a bunch of those at the end. Chances are I will be. Um, Devin, why don't you come over here and skate for a little while? Uh, <laughs> you still got this negative one. She's here publicly disgraced. And look at her over there. She is just going to town on this. All right. She seems to be doing just fine. I'm not going to mess with her. She's okay. Um, apparently somebody took care of my kid, which is all I really wanted. 
you. Okay. I just want you to get something to eat. And then, yes, you want a greeting card and a snow angel. I can do that. Um, which one of these do I not want? That. <laughs> I don't care about that. Um, do you want one? No. Alright, get whatever you want. Onion rings. That's what it is. <laughs> that's the one you're getting. May not be what you want, that's what you're getting. Okay, well, when he's finished, we're going to take a picture. Who is this lady? Stella Stryker. Do we know Stella Stryker? I don't yeah, we know her. We met her. That's right. Um, we were talking about possibly stealing her husband but, or boyfriend or brother or son. I don't know who he is. <clears throat> I forgot. Okay, I'm going to have you get off of this thing, and I'm going to let you take a greeting card photo with Dawson, Devin, and Shelton, and... That should stop everybody, whatever they're doing. They should come over and get this done. Hopefully it won't lock them in there. Sometimes I have a habit of that happening to my game. I don't like it, but it happens. What in the world? Oh, <laughs> that's where the food truck goes. I was going to say, why do they have random cones out? Yeah, it's Bridgeport. They can do all kinds of strange things. Um, who are you? Oh! Good. At least he's going in. Um, did you go in here? And now you're back to walking. Well, this, I can't really say that this is definitely the same walking issue you had, because I know a lot of my sims do this, but I was kind of hoping that you would go. You can see the fog now, by the way. I mean, it's not overly foggy. It's, it's got that creepy atmosphere, which I love, but um, it's not just, like, so thick you can't see. So, I don't know. I'd have to go back and see what the actual perk is. I don't know that it's really anything big. And there's our little family, um, minus Madeline, which, of course, I'm not going to post that because in case some of you haven't seen anything, you won't know. Um, I haven't posted some of the previous episodes. I'm a little bit further ahead. I'm going to do something that's going to get her scandalized just because I can. Cure. What? Cure him from what? Seriously? I don't know what that means. Um... Oh, that's the the mood the mood thing. So you can do it with the other people. Oh, I didn't know that. See, I never played with that thing, so I had no idea. All right, let's go ahead and get something to drink real quick from him. And the rest of you guys, you're kind of on your own. I don't care what you do. We are going to get home in a decent hour tonight, hopefully. See what? Oh no 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 no! Through the scarf again. <laughs> And let's just wait and see. Oh, she probably got you. She caught you. Or he. I don't know who it is. Um, Alright, so you're fine. Um, what do you guys want to do? Anything? Not really. He wants to do a snow angel, so I figured might as well go do that. Get that out of your way. <laughs> That's off your bucket list. Um, let's see, what do you want? Uh, do you want to go play with the snowboard, the snowball thing? We could. <laughs> Or you guys could just sit here and be romantic. Go ahead and actually make out with your husband. Um, you can embrace him. And there we go. Shelton. Oh, he's over here. He's like, I already found what I want to do. I don't have to wait on you. You take too long. I do. I'm so sorry. So go snowboarding. You're about to do it. And Devin. All right. Just keeping the relationship strong as best as I can. Um, you're going to go ahead and actually dispel the rumors with your wife. I'm sure she knows that you didn't do whatever it was. Oh, you did do it. <laughs> I'm sorry. You did. You're so guilty. Um, but this does, doesn't matter. All right. And... Okay. Oh, poor guy. Did that help you at all? Yeah, no, not really. So I guess we're going to have to go over there and sue, I guess. Um, I hope not, but we might ask to turn. No, I don't want to be turned. Um, oh, it's going to snow. <laughs> that's, that's nice. Let's go ahead and kiss in this while it's snowing. And where is City Hall? Because I want to see if he can actually go. Nope, not it. That's it. I mean, I can see it. No, that's not it. It's that one, I believe, right there. Can you sue? Yes, you can go sue. Alright, well, 
if you were a witch, you're going out. You're going to go sue for slander, and I'm going to send her home. Um, she's not tired. They're not. He's tired. You, Where? you'll be tired by the time you get home. So, at least he's running. Um, he's not going to walk all the way there, which is a good thing. If he doesn't get it done, it's okay. Um, I just figure we'll get to give it a shot. He does work tomorrow, I believe, uh, in 14 hours. Worst case, I'll throw a potion at him, and he'll be up at least for part of the day, and I won't have to mess with him. All right, let me go check on my kid, because I'm sure she's fine. No, she's not. <laughs> she's exhausted. The butler did nothing. All right, so butler, you're worthless. We're going to change her. Um, we will take care of her, I promise. This is the bad thing about leaving them to the care of butlers. Okay, you feed her on the floor, and then, um, I'll wait. Okay. Oh, you're already here? Man, you got up here pretty quick. Let's go ahead and jump in here in the shower, since you're close, and we'll get you to bed. Um, I know it's not that late. It's almost midnight, which in Bridgeport really isn't late, but these guys... Are you shorting out? Oh, where? <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm just gonna cry. I forgot. You can't be out in the snow. <laughs> it's my own fault. I am so sorry. It's pitiful. But you know what? Nobody's coming back for you because we just don't want to. We're too lazy to come out of the, of the, the um, penthouse. So when you finally undo what you're doing, come on home. <laughs> we'll figure you out then. Alright, Lacey, hopefully you are there taking care of your kid that nobody else is going to take care of. Good. And she actually doesn't need a whole lot. I am going to get all of this topped out before I put her to bed because as a baby she was a nightmare. As a toddler she could be even worse. Hopefully she won't be, but she could be. And then what I want you to do, I know you probably already have, well, I'm sure you have everything that you need, but I'm not going to mess with it. Let's take you over here to, the butler did not even make your bed, did he? Let's go make your bed while she actually drinks. And you, <clears throat> at least you're in bed. Devin, you're suing, and when you get done, whether you win or lose, you need to come on home. Um. He's hungry, but I think I can wait and do that later. I think what we'll do is we'll just go ahead and have you do this and this. And get you straight to bed. Um, should I give him a potion? How much time has he got? 12 hours? Yeah, we'll give him a potion so I can get him up early. Um, he did his opportunity, which was good. But, you know, just in case he has to come back and sue again, he can do that. First thing in the morning. All right. Lacey. It's going to take you forever to do this, isn't it? <laughs> Fine. This kid is exhausted and she needs to, she needs to go to bed. <sighs> Not exactly the room I would put for a kid. This probably would have been the better choice. But the butler was sleeping in the bed the day that I did this. So I'm like, I didn't have much of a choice. All right, so once you do that, then you can come back over here. Put her in the crib and I'm going to send you on to bed too. So that way, they're all taken care of. I'm going to go hang out with him after I know that she's done what she's supposed to do, um, which I think she will. Stay away. <laughs> Stay away, stupid lady who doesn't do anything. Uh, all right, Devin, he won. Good for him. <laughs> we did your job before you came to do it. Well, you know, that's just the way it is. All right, so I know that she's going to do this. Let me go with Shelton. I'll be back when we'll finish up the last day. All right, well, today is Devin's birthday, but Lacey got scandalized because of biting in public, which, of course, she knew she would. He had an issue that he couldn't sleep in the bed, this is Devin, and that kind of ticked me off, so I finally just had him go over here and sleep in Dawson's bed with him. Um, I don't know what the, deal, what the deal is, but apparently maybe it had something to do with the scandal. I don't know. Um, it's his birthday, so he'll age up at some point today. You, now that you're up, um, I don't know what you're going to go do. Synthesized pancake. We don't have a synthesizer, do we? Oh, I should have waited to see where you were gonna go with that. Seriously, we do not have the. We don't have that. At least not that I'm aware of. Um, I didn't put any into the future stuff in here. Um, maybe the uh, maybe the butler made it. I don't know. I don't know how they would. What are you doing in my house, Gene Miller? Go away. Uh, all right, why don't we go ahead and ask him to leave when you get up? No. Can you make him disappear? If 
I was a genie, I could. <laughs> I could get rid of him. You can ask him to leave. Um, yeah, you don't even know him. Let's do a friendly introduction and then say, please go home. Okay, the kid is actually in pretty decent shape, so she didn't really go down that bad. Um, I'm, I'm happy, so it looks like she'll be a better child than she was a, a better toddler than a baby, which is good. Okay, you, why don't you go ahead and get downstairs. Um, here's what we're going to do. We are going to go ahead and have plasma juice. And um, the kid just needs a little bit. So we're going to go take care of her. She's still sleeping. I don't really want to mess with her. And I really want you to get up and get ready first. But he works today, doesn't he? Oh, yeah, he doesn't have time. Well, you may not be the one that does the books, so it may be Lacey. Um, in fact, I'm guaranteeing it right now. I'm sure she has these books. If I want to go hunt down through the chest, I can find them. But I don't. I don't want to go look. You need your multi-tab back for a minute. I should get him his own. But I figured we had some from, like, Terra and... Yeah, we got plenty. So there you go. You get a multi-tab. <clears throat> you go ahead and actually... We'll buy some books, and we will get paddling up in just a little bit. Yeah, she needs to redo some of her friendships, which it's unfortunate that that happened, but it does happen. Um, oh, we don't, we're not even friends with our maid? All right, we'll, we'll become friends with the maid, at least. Well, we first got to start with Lenny. Okay, children. Um, how many times have I bought this game, these stupid books? Um... Now, I do like the area for the kids here in Bridgeport. It's pretty easy. So it shouldn't be hard for her to get in there and get that done. Um, there's a lot of room in there. There also is a lot of stuff in there, too, if we wanted to actually leave her there, even as a toddler. Um, who am I working on? <laughs> I forgot. Lacey and who? Uh, Lenny. Okay, well, Lenny. There you go. And I guess this all came from her scandal. But she did cure herself. I did make her do that. Um, Alright, we gotta work on this then. Ah, I hit the wrong thing. Do that by accident. I don't mean to. Alright, Chantel. I didn't know you knew Chantel. I didn't know who she was, but apparently you do. Or Crystal. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, that was the, um, the bartender, wasn't it? I think it was. <clears throat> Which we still probably have to go over there, I guess. I need to go check it. Or go look at the last episode and find out. Alright, let's get Shonda. I hate losing friends and having to redo this. I really do. It just takes me off. It's like, ah, we were doing everything. It was my own fault. I shouldn't have made her do that. And um, I think there's a reward trait that you can get, which kind of stops all that. But I forgot what it was. <laughs> I did. I thought she had just about everything. So, all right, you're going to become best friends with her. So that should cover you. Um, yeah, look at all this. All right, Layla, you're next. Let's go with you. It's easy points. Um, it's just time consuming because you got to scroll through all of these. There's not, well, I mean, there's a way to filter it, but it's not going to help us at this point. All right, Layla. Wow, you guys dropped really low. Okay, and the next one is Stella. Now, she's a celebrity too, but it doesn't really matter for you because ha, you've got your points. Um, but if you don't do this, we'll be booed and we won't get invited to parties that we won't go to. So, you know, there is a purpose. Um, Stella. Where are you? Right in front of me. Um, best friend. I don't really have much else planned today. Is that Ebony's or Johnny? Okay. Okay, so Johnny it is. Let's go with you. I bet the kid is probably... Yeah, she's probably not, not up yet. That was Johnny right there. I saw him. I like Johnny's house, and I've had it before. You have to wait till they die or move away. Um, or if you can go in there and evict them, you can take it right away. But I typically let them have it. Okay, Arthur, how many friends did you lose? It didn't give us a little thing. It didn't say anything, or at least I didn't catch it. Or maybe it did it when the it was on speed three. Um, I'm assuming it did. Who was this person? <laughs> I forgot. Arthur. Okay, so we need to find Lacey first. Um, uh, Arthur Hamilton. Never heard of you. You must be an NPC. 
Alright, hang on, stop it. I had somebody else there. Lee. Okay, so hopefully this is the last one. I think it is. If not, we're just going to say it is, I think, because I'm tired of doing this. That's why I didn't want to do the blog. I forgot that we had to do it. I still have to go back. I could start her now and get it done or get it started, and then she'd have less to do. I probably should do that, shouldn't I? Yeah. We're going to end up doing this over and over again, so I probably will. Let me go up here and check on the kid. Yeah, the kid's fine. kid is up. Let's go up here and change her. Um, we will change her again because she'll probably pee on us. We're going to feed her. Um, do you need anything? Eh, you're just going to go jump in the shower. Uh, yeah, he can talk to you. It doesn't matter to me. Hopefully, oh no, you didn't. <laughs> Alright, no, it was the wrong person. <laughs> you can do this. Why don't you tell him to go home? Um, ask to leave. Can we ask to leave? No. <laughs> Can you just tell him to go home? No, fine. You guys are on your own. You. Oh, yeah, you're the one talking to Ebony. Okay, that's fine. Uh, who's calling me now? I'm ignoring it. Devin, when you get out of here or you get done, um, I don't even care what you need. We're going downstairs. Let's get you in the lobby real quick. Let's go ahead and go here. <clears throat> if you're down there, you can check the mail. Let's go do it. Um, don't clean up. I don't care if you clean up. Oh, man. Well, fine. You're still getting the mail. <laughs> You're still going to do it. Feed this kid. Ignore your phone because I'm tired of it. And probably got that glitch because I didn't think about it. Oh, no, I didn't. All right. Feed her real quick. Um, I'm going to give you a little bit of time. Your thirst goes down way too fast. Of course, it's the cheap plasma juice if you did the um, either the plasma fruit or drinking from another sim I think it's a lot a lot better it's more fulfilling he's honking at you I don't care he's going he's slow <laughs> all right you want to actually do uh, you know what if we if we woohoo with you you're gonna get you're gonna get scandalized so but we're just gonna, still gonna do it it's worth more points so <laughs> we'll do it maybe if I try not to do it um, when it's, what you call it, when it's quite so busy. No, you're not getting answered the phone. Kid, are you good? Yes, you are. All right, we're going to go back in here and pick her up, and then we're going to go. Look, that stupid phone. Leave her alone. She doesn't want to talk to any of you. Um, is this a library? No, that's a house. <laughs> this is the library. I was like, I know it's around here somewhere. Okay, let's take Madeline with us and head out to the library. This will be an event. This will probably take us till, what time is it now? One, it'll probably take us till about 4.30 or 5 by the time we get there. But we'll give it a shot. Eh, come on, get in the house. I'm ignoring calls. I wish you could just have it to where it's set up to just automatically go to a voicemail or something. I hate it. I just don't like it. I'm that way in the real world, too, though. I hate when the phone rings. I just cringe. I think it comes from long, 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 long time ago in a former lifetime, I had a job where I had to answer the phone all the time. Oh, it was awful. <laughs> it just got old. And ever since then, I have never wanted to be on the phone again. I used to love being on the phone as a kid. And as a teenager, couldn't get me off. But now, uh -uh. I will not get on that phone unless I absolutely have to. Okay, you... Well, if this guy is here, why don't you guys go ahead and you can't do this with um with him? Seriously? I thought you could. You can. Alright, why don't you guys have fun together? You're at work and I told you business as usual, which I believe you need to work on relationships, so let's go ahead and do that. And I know you need to work on your boss at some point, but we'll do that for now. <clears throat> Is that the idiot that's finally leaving Gene, John? Yeah. Oh, he's paparazzi? Zip, zip. How dare you get in my house? <laughs> I mean, that's awful. You make me want to get out that door of life and death and just feed you to the door monster. We haven't done that, have we? Or did we Did we do that in Riverview? I kind of think we did. I kind of think we did because we had that house and we built the garage with the, um, 
the little suite for the other guys. So I believe we had the, the door of life and death. So we've already done that. Oh yeah, we fed them. We took them over there to the cemetery. So yeah, we've used that. We're supposed to try to use everything. This over here is the actual kids area. So I'm gonna have her bring Madeline there, and then she can start working uh, or start reading. She doesn't go to work for three more days. Man. Now I get the glitch, and it happens all the time where they get stuck reading the books and I hope that doesn't happen but I'm going to tell you right now that if it does and it um, freezes or locks her up I will cheat and I will teleport both of them right back here and I will reset their needs to whatever they're at which she's in pretty decent shape and she's in really good shape so just be forewarned <laughs> if it does it I won't even I won't even do anything I'm just going to teleport them over because to me that's just such an issue I don't know why it does it um, I've looked into it and there's just seems to be no solution no re no rhyme or reason for it but that's okay all right let's start with typical start with my reds I do it like a stoplight so let's start with red then go to yellow then go to green <laughs> now we haven't seen her play around with the animals and bite them which we're gonna do um, she needs the actual teddy bear. I think she can also do it with her, uh, what should we call it, her imaginary friend, but I haven't tried it. We'll try, but if not, it's not a big deal. Oh, there's a fight going on. I can hear it. I can't see it. Hang on, hang on. Who's fighting? Who is fighting in this place? You do not fight in the library, do you? Well, some people do. All right, it's not downstairs. It must be upstairs. Or maybe it's outside. It's probably outside. I heard it. I really did. Back it up if you think I'm lying. <laughs> I promise you I heard it. Oh, wait. It's right there. It's Bo. <laughs> He's fighting him. Who did he fight? Oh, man. Uh, they live together, so <laughs> life must not be very good for them. Uh, Bo won. And are you going to go after it again? No. <laughs> Let me come back and check on you. And what do you know? Is she stuck again? No, she's not stuck. Scared me. <laughs> you really scared me that it was going to happen already. Um, yeah, he can go do this. It's actually worth a decent amount of money. And I think he can do it right after work. I hope he can. Um, oh, wait, they're fighting again. <laughs> I want to see you guys fight some more. Come on. Oh, man, that is a face. Oh. She almost looks really sad for a moment. I like her. Yeah, I was going to go after him, and then I just, I don't know. It was just kind of a last minute thing. But I thought about it, and maybe, I don't know. Don't know if we should have or not, but that was what I was going to do. Okay, I need to set you up with the next ones, which would be yellow. TV. The reason I do it is that at the very end it gets them all lined up in order so you know which ones you've done and if you missed anything. So, that's just my system. I know other people have their own, but that's the way I do it. Not that it really matters. Now, they don't have any... Oh, they do have the stuff. Yay, can I move it? No, you can't move it, otherwise you can steal it. Um, <laughs> I am being the criminal element today. Uh, or trying to be. Oh, look, they got cupcakes on there. I... I've never recolored it. I just always stick it out there from the um, from the get go. Okay, so we got the red books done. Let's work on the yellow. I'll come back in a minute. I'm gonna go see the fight again. I have no idea what the boys are doing. I don't care. Oh, they got bored fighting. I'm sorry. And she's over here now. <laughs> they went to separate corners. <laughs> I like it. Now this this library does not have skill books, so you have to actually edit it. Which, being the fact that we own it, we could. Um, in fact, I don't even know what our requirements are to actually update or upgrade this thing. Um, can I do it here? Let's see what we'd have to do. Oh, it's already fully upgraded, so we don't have to do a thing. Well, that's nice. Um, but yeah, we would actually need to put those in if you needed them. But like I said, she's already at the point where she doesn't really need any books for skills. The other family members might, but she doesn't. So I'm not too concerned. Um, Alright, your needs are... Yeah, you can be better, but they're not bad. Hers aren't bad. I think they do have a potty in here, don't they? No, they don't. Darn it. 
Would have been nice. All right, Devin, please tell me you're going to go straight over there and do the commercial. Please tell me you will. And he's happy about something. Oh, he got a promotion. All right, <laughs> good for him. I didn't hear it. I didn't. Okay, good. So he's got a promotion to personal assistant. Now making 52. What level is that? Four? That's four. That's good. Especially since he's going to age up tonight. And he's got to go six more levels. Yikes. I don't know if he'll make it or not. He'll try, but... Uh, if he does, he does. If he doesn't, then I'm in trouble. Actually, all he has to do is get level five of... Um, no, he does have to max it. I forgot. i got to max his career. But he's got plenty of time. Three weeks as an adult and two and a half as a elder. He should have plenty of time to do it. As long as I don't mess him up. And his charisma's good. His celebrity's good. So, are you a paparazzi too? Yes, you are. It doesn't take him long and they find you. At least she's not in my house. <clears throat> I don't want her in my house. I don't want any of them in my house. Um, okay. So, so far, not too bad. Finish up these last two books and we are done. Yeah, she wants to advance, but you know this is what happens when you have maternity leave. You kind of get stuck behind. Um, I'm going to lock that in. I don't know that I'll take it or do it. 275, 275. This one's a definite, so we're going to do that one. All right. When you're finished, you're going to pick her up. Yes. And take care of all of these. Go ahead and change her. And then we're going to head home. Which is pretty cool. I mean, we'll have gotten all this done. Um, oh, yeah. You're at the same place, too. So guess who gets to do some more work? Business model. Can you do it? Oh, man. Oh, man. You missed it. Go home. <laughs> Go home. You really aggravate me that you didn't make it. Ah, that's so sad. I thought he had it. Maybe he has a day off. I don't know. What is tomorrow? Yeah, he's got the next two days off. But I don't know if you can do those opportunities on these days off. We'll wait and find out. Um, see, tonight's the night we should be going out. And it's already 8 o'clock. But I wanted to get this done because while I had the kid, the only th two things I've got left would be the xylophone and the peg box. Uh, and then I'm done. So, um, do we want to go to this party? Go to the party, I don't care. We'll see if he goes. <laughs> he probably won't. That stupid phone. I hate that phone. Just stop calling. I don't want to call. I don't want anything. Is he going? Yeah, he's going to go to the party. I'm going to stop him so he doesn't go all the way home. And we'll go check on him in just a little bit and see if he's not doing anything horrible. Um, Alright, you guys are here. I'm going to go make sure that she puts uh, Madeline back where she needs to be. Look at him. Okay. Um, Madeline's room is up here. So, Lacey, when you get here, let's go ahead and have you... Is Madeline tired? No, she's not tired at all. Um, let's put her here. Mm, yes. And if I can find you before you actually get out of the building... Oh, come on. <laughs> Seriously. That phone is still ringing. Um... You'll feed her there, too. All right. Then... Okay, the phone stopped. Good. You can go ahead and take care of this real quick. Yeah, I know you want plasma juice, but, you know, that stuff is so cheap. Well, we're going to get it. We're going to lock it in because I'm sure you'll drink it again. And I'm going to go check on Devin real quick. So hopefully she'll be done. Where's her house? Oh, she actually has a real house. This was an easy party. Cool, Devin. I'm glad you came. Um, why can't I not get in? <laughs> I'm like, I'm locked. Ah. You're going to throw this party without, <laughs> without a pool. All right, go ahead and talk to this guy. Who are you? We want to greet somebody. <clears throat> There's not much in this house, and I don't know. Oh, that's little bling. <laughs> all right. Not much here at all. You will not get any sleep. <laughs> don't even try, because she's going to keep you up. Come on. Oh, she has to go to the bathroom anyway, so what's the big deal? Talk to him and so, so. Um, talk to her too since she's getting up. Maybe, maybe not. Talk to her. Let's go ahead and do 
<laughs> I truly agree. Poor thing. And can we talk to you? Ask her about her day. <laughs> Bunch of idiots. All right, fine. Doesn't look like it's a party that we're really missing, so we're not going to go. Devin can stay there for all he wants to do with... Oh, man, it's birthday time. Sorry, didn't mean to go. At least you actually had people at your birthday, so that's good. And hopefully he doesn't have a midlife crisis, but... Yeah, he might. Um... Oh, I thought he got a star. I was going to get all happy that he got a star. It's okay. And see if you change anything at all. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Doesn't look like he changed anything. Okay. Midlife crisis, yes or no? I say no. Um... And it's a no. Wow, it was good today. All right, go ahead and go home. I'm done with that. I'm done with the party. You guys are pretty sad. Okay, so did you get her up there? Did you feed her? Yes, you did. No? Yes, maybe. Take care of yourself. And then um, I want you to go over here and I want you to make a sleeping potion because you used a couple of them. Let's go ahead and make two of them. And with my kid, since she's not too tired, Oh, Lord have mercy. I gotta go take care of that. Oh, no, no, no. You're not doing this. You'll do one of them. Then you can come over here and you can change her. Um, and that should be about it. Then you go back and make another one of these. Um, and what I will do to kind of keep her working, she was working on the peg box, I believe. So we'll take this upstairs, put it over... Can we put it in front of the window? I really don't want it right there. Um, I guess that's a good place. Now I want you, when you get done with this, don't do anything. I want you to... Oh, you can't do anything with it? Alright, well, here. I didn't want to go into build by because it takes so long to get in. Um, just trying to avoid it. But now that we're here, let's go ahead and grab a teddy bear and up the ones... The one she's going to get is the vampire bear. So we'll get the vampire bear for her. And I'm going to have her go over here. I know you can do it with the imaginary friend too, but she's going to go over here and play with him for just a minute. We'll just see her bite him um, before Lacey comes over and actually interrupts her, which will not take long. I hope they can get a better view of it. I don't know if it happens right away, but I know that they will do it. They'll pretend to bite. <laughs> Go ahead, do it. You're making me into a liar, so go ahead and do it. Just bite the thing. They're supposed to, at least. Oh, it's too late. <laughs> it's too late. Uh, that's not it. I don't think. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong. Alright, let's take care of this kid, and then... We can get her started back on the peg box. And I'll be happy. I'll have most everything done for her. And then the rest of it is just waiting on her to age up, which I like. I like to be done and not have to mess with it. Um, I did tell you to do pretty much everything good. Devin, I brought you home, and you are starving. Where are you at? You're right there. Did you eat? I don't know what he's going to go do. Where in the world are you getting the synthesized mac and cheese that you're waiting on. I think you just lost your mind. Alright, let's go ahead and have a um, mushroom omelet. What are you boys doing? You're both just standing around like idiots. You need to eat too, so let's get you to eat um, strawberry pancakes. I bet you need something. Uh, Alright, go to bed. You can go do that. You, when you're finished, we will send you... It's only 1 o'clock. It's really not that late, but it's okay. Um... I send you over here to make a couple more of these. He's not working, so I don't have to worry about him, but I am going to get him to take care of bathroom needs first. So let's go ahead and keep you. And rather than going to bed right away, let's take, take a nap or take a bath. You, you're fine, but you probably want to go to bed too, don't you? No, you're going to drink. <laughs> and my kid, nope, you're not going to play with this thing. See, she won't even go to the other one. You're going to play with that. I should have... Um, I shouldn't have let you go to bed. I'm going to spring you back up. <laughs> I'm going to make you get up and work. 
you're gonna come up here and play with her keep her happy um he was probably already in bed wasn't he yes he was <laughs> poor thing i'm so cruel to my simpot even though i like him all right you get up there and go take care of her uh, you want to go out on the town you already did <laughs> we've gone out several times and you lost that wish okay with you i do need you to go jump in the shower when you get finished who was screaming because i heard you mm. Uh, clean the dishes. I don't think this counts. You have to actually do it in the sink. <clears throat> I have nothing else for you to do. I really don't. Um, I guess you could go on to bed because it is getting a little bit later. Shelton, I probably should have just let you stay where you were. But, you know, that's fine. He can do this. You, when you finish up, you're going to go on to bed. Lacey, I'm going to send you on to bed too. Um, so you don't have that much to do. And so what we will do is we'll work on Madeline. Um, I'm going to let her try to get, let's, she won't finish it, but she'll get as far as she can, and then I'll put her back into the crib, knowing that the last things we have to work on is this one and the xylophone, and then we are completely done with her, which I'm happy. I'm really happy about that. It's just a nice feeling to have it all done. Yeah, it's easier to do two kids at a time if you have the crib out so you can keep their needs up, but, you know, this is fine too. If you've got a lot of extra hands, it's pretty good. And, surprise, surprise, we made it through with all of our elders still alive, which there's only one that's at risk, which is not a problem. Um, yeah, that would just be Shelton. So I have no idea how old he is. I could check. I'm not going to because I kind of like the surprise. <laughs> He's all excited in the bathtub. And then, did I send you or did you went to bed? Yes. All right, so now that they're basically wrapping it up for the night, I'm going to wrap it up as well. When we come back tomorrow, we have got the last bit of winter to take care of. And um, we should be seeing, finally, Lacey getting off of maternity leave. Oh, well, Lacey, guess what? <laughs> you got a job now. Uh, that's kind of good. Don't worry, Devin. Just get out of the way so she can fix it. Did I tell you to go to bed? I did, but you're taking your time. Get in there. Go get in there and get out. All right, so we'll get her to take care of this. And then a lot of our stuff is getting, is getting fixed, which is good. Um... Your needs are okay. All right, she is going to probably max this out. So hopefully she does. And when she does it, Shelton's going to bed. She's going to bed, and we are wrapping things up. So I'm going to give it just a second or two more just to finish up. Unless this is just skill point number two. There you go. You're done. You are finished. You are finished. All right, you go ahead and actually put her in the crib. We are done with that one. I am so happy. Okay. And when you finish that, you can come on back to bed. Oh, hush. <laughs> I'm taking care of you now. Just listen to what I'm doing. All right, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you next time.